Hello and welcome back to episode 18 of Quantum Break. I'm Vic and you're watching yet another Let's Play channel. So this choice remains before us. Is Paul going to hang on to his crusade and carry it through? Or is he going to give up and turn on the people that he believes has turned on him? And prior to walking up these stairs, uh, I would have said that Paul would be all in on seeing this through to the end. Um, but that comment about what's the point in saving people that I can't trust, that really undermines that fanaticism that I saw in him. And, you know, uh, anything that is sufficiently traumatic enough to turn him away from that fanaticism would probably just push him way over to the other pole. So you know what? We're going to go with Surrender. Sir? Uh, are you alright? Who put you up to this? Sir, you ordered us to go through Dr. Kim's lab. Find what we can... Who are you working for? You, sir! Liar! What the fuck?! He's figured out where the other time machine is. And now? Yeah, I mean, I can understand why most people would go the other way. Oh, goody, time to watch some TV. Paul Sawin's become unhinged. What about my treatments? He's triggered a catastrophe. The Joyceville could collapse within eight hours. He has the chance to fix it, but he's choosing not to. He's choosing to let things end. And this is where we come in. Good evening, Dr. Amaral. Five minutes out, Mr. Hatch. I've come to free you, my friend. It's time for you to rejoin the others, to return to the infinite. What was troubling me is who got them in the Kim's lab. She paid a visit minutes before the explosion. I need her found now. Liam? <laughs> I have some information about Martin Hatch. I want him apprehended immediately. And so where is he now? Lifeboat protocol. Weren't we on episode four before? I'm going to have to watch out for a copyright strike here. Nice Windows product placement, Microsoft. Surface tablet. He looks better than he did in the cutscene. gonna break that keyboard man Dr. Holden? What the hell is it? 
protocol has been initiated. Vault Tech has been activated. I can't. I can't be happening. I'm afraid we have no time. I need to wake my family. Your family won't be necessary. That's a weird way to phrase it. Where's Martin, though? He's gonna kill her. Look at you. You need your treatments. He didn't even use any time powers or nothing. He just, he just bonked her on the head. Fucking amateurs. Why are you doing a port scan on your own network? He here to do something for Martin. Come on, Fiona. Pick up, pick up, pick up. Maybe he never cared Come about on, what up. Martin wanted. Come on, pick up. Pick up. Beth, I don't know if you can hear this, but it's Fiona. I need your help. Do you copy? It's Fiona, do you copy? Beth, it didn't work. I'm sorry. I couldn't find the protocol. Jack. Yes, you're yes, speaking. This is Jack Joyce. Beth told me you were working together. This might be the only ally I have left. What happened? Serene. There wasn't anything I could do, but Fiona, there is something we can do now. I need to find something we'll call the countermeasure. 
12 sided, small, metallic. Like a soccer ball. The CFR. 12 sided and metallic. The chronon field regulator. That is the countermeasure. And it can fix the fracture. I still don't understand why Paul didn't just use it to reverse the fracture. And if the lifeboat's not ready, what good is all this going to do? Basement five. And then he's just riddled with bullets. Why not just make the whole building into the the lifeboat? Just build it right into the outer walls. Those floors look old. Yeah, it doesn't look very ready to house all those people, does it? Seriously, where's Martin, though? Paul gonna kill him too? CFR to fix the fracture. We need to get it to him. It's CFR is what's powering this place right now. Be honest. But I spoke to him. I spoke to Jack Joyce, and he needs it. Just, if you 
If you let Joyce use the CFR, then that means the lifeboat's gone. No, no, no. That's not, no. That's These not people the... down here, they can figure it out. They can fix the fracture. That's what you wanted These in the people? first place. These people, this is Monarch, okay? They're the ones that got us into this. Do you think they give a shit about any of us? Also, you won't need the lifeboat or to fix the fracture. I mean, you realize what you're asking. If Jack just does it. What's the plan once we get to Monarch? We need to find a way onto the lifeboat. We know where the CFR is, but... Jack, it's Charlie, listen. It's at the top of the Monarch Tower, so you gotta follow my instructions exactly. Jack. Jack? 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 Fiona, stop. Jack! No, no, no. Look. That area up there is insanely secure. He's not gonna be able to get in. Hey, 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 wait! Wait. I need to finish this. I know, but I'm the one that should go. The CFR defenses. There's no way he's gonna be able to get past them alone. I'm the only one. I mean, you belong down here. You actually would be useful. I'm dead weight. Just, I'm a glorified locksmith. Why don't you let somebody else be the hero? What does she even hey, do? Tough chick? Everyone needs IT, Charlie. Fuck you. Hey, Charlie. You're an okay date. I know. Whatever. So I'm still waiting for the part where Liam Burke turns out to be an asset to Paul Serene. Why do they even wear those helmets? Your phone doesn't work down here, girl. Our war is underway. And the time has come to fight for our place in this existence. My enemies, some have shown their faces, others are still out there. And I think of all of you. like he wasn't shot at all. Who else is gonna do it, huh? Well, what I'm doing right now, where I'm going, it's not about me. You said you would get us on that list. Yeah, I know that's what I said, but plans the have list, changed. The list, Charlie. Joyce can fix the fracture. You're running out of words, Charlie. I am. 
That's what you care about, right? Right? I mean, that's what you're doing this for, huh? Huh? That's why you left everything in Monarch for your family. And for what? So you could raise your kids in a glorified basement? Because that's all the lifeboat's gonna be. I mean, Serene's lost his mind. If the lifeboat was the answer, don't you think I would be on it? Hmm? I mean, listen to this guy. He's insane. Okay, hey, okay, 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 look. Joyce fixes the fracture, he fixes the world. We all go home happy. But I have to help him, and I can't do that if you kill me. If you're wrong about this, I know, don't worry. I'll shoot myself. <laughs> Lose the harness. I get it, you know, we have trust issues. Whatever. An army with the power to prove to the world that you can travel this road, you can prevail. I think the CFR is going to be where it belongs. That's it. Looks like a CFR to me. What a cute little hacker phone. Oh, I know. Do an LS-L. Yeah. There you go. There he is. Oh... Liam. Drop it. You know about Chekhov's gun? Hey! That wasn't it. My world will see balance. Okay. Uh, let me let me see what I can do for you. Can you uh... get ready for Chekhov's gun? Don't you 
I'm only sorry I did not get sooner. Just hang on. I'd give anything for that year. I'd give anything for that year. Doing another damn port scan. Right, and Liam being an asset was on the other Paul Serene choice. Chekhov's gun incoming. So I guess I'm not going to learn what Martin Hatch's deal was. His deal. What is he? Thought he was some kind of shifter cultist, but Are you okay? Yeah. Thank you. Ah oh, shit. Jack on his way? Proof. What? I have to help Jack Joyce. Hey, come here. What's your name? Uh, em Emily. Emily what? Burke? Uh, Emily Burke. Okay. I'm putting your name on the list for the lifeboat. Look, you gotta go take the elevator all the way down. You'll know when you see it. Yeah. All right? I got it. Once you get down there, I want you to find Fiona Miller for me, okay? Can you do that? Yeah. Tell her what happened here. Tell her this world, it's a weird place. Nah. That's always gonna need people like her. 
to help understand it. And then I'm gonna help make it right. Help keep it going. Tell her. I finally feel connected. Does he think he's gonna die or something? End of episode four. And also, end of episode 18. Come back and see me again in episode 19 for what's probably going to be the beginning of the last chapter of Quantum Break. Talk to you soon.